Hey guys, I'm here. I'm here with my very real back, uh, background. Very real. I don't know if you guys could tell. Well, Ralph, you got a green screen as well. I, no, it's not green screen. This is, I built this. You built, I built it. You're actually in the chapel right now. I am. Beautiful. It looks totally <laughs> not like I'm on a green screen at all, either, <laughs> which is the which is the good news. Well, I think I think your chapel is very well lit. Like on, on you know, there's lots of lighting over here. <laughs> yeah, it's weird. It, it's <laughs> we're working on the lighting. Um, we're working on the lighting, but we're getting there, guys. Um, so we're going to bring on some special guests again from Science Base because um, we're we're going to be showing some more stuff today, right, Chris? Uh, lots of really cool stuff. Uh, we're just uh, waiting for, wow, 20, not even two minutes, 24 people are already here, 25, it's going on. Uh, we got Jan in the house, Joshua, John, Michael, Mike James. Hello, everyone. Thank you so much for tuning in. Uh, so we're going to, uh, I guess, uh, wait for a couple more minutes for more people to arrive, but thank you so much for tuning in. You, if you, if you have not signed up for the beta, for Van Helsing Online yet, please do so. You could go to zeniscope.com slash page slash Van Helsing Online. You can sign up for the beta, you can download it. Uh, and we're gonna be going through some of those details like how to log in, how to create your avatar, uh, a little bit more in-depth look of the proving grounds and we might be doing uh, a death match as well. So uh, really, really important news and updates today as well. Um, and if you sign up for the beta, you, you can still get uh, an achievement badge for being one of the first 1,000 people to sign up. So, um, and it's a, it's, a, it's a small badge of pride. So shout out to everyone at Science Base and shout out to you, all of our lovely Van Helsing fans. Uh, we have so many more people coming in the stream. Right, it's great. It's loading up. Yeah, we're about to we're about to show you guys some really cool stuff. Walk through some of the some of the uh, basics. Mm -hmm. uh, whatever these guys uh, uh, want to show us today, I think they have a lot already going on. And they keep, I, as far as I get, as far as we understand it, is they keep building out more and more. Yeah. So it's, it's going to be built out really quickly. Um, but I'm excited because I've seen some of the stuff already and it's pretty amazing. Um, do you yeah. want to? I think we should bring James on. Yeah. Uh, one, one last thing. Uh, Patrick, if you want to set up to the beta, all you have to do is, oh, I just lost the link. Here, oh, here we go. Yep, just go to zeniscope.com slash page slash Van Helsing Online. You can sign up for the beta there. You can download the, the installer and um, th there's a bunch of directions that, uh, or tutorials there. Uh, once, you're, once you download that patch or that, that program, you can create an account, start creating your avatar and you're good to go. And if you sign up for the beta uh, and you're one of the first 1,000 people to sign up, you could get a special uh, achievement badge, uh, like so. Here Ooh. we go. Here's that, and, nice. here, and here's nice. another badge. So very, nice. very cool. All right, um, so Rob, uh, I am inside the game. This yep. is me. I'm actually <laughs> literally inside the game. Um, yeah. So Rob, I'm gonna pop off. off. All right. Are you leaving us? Or 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 you? I'll bring you me? back. We'll bring you back. Yeah. Okay. I just like oh. the headphones. Okay. <laughs> Okay, this looks real. <laughs> I gotta work on my green screen. Okay, I'm bringing on James. He's not on green screen. <clears throat> up, man? No, I'm on LA screen. How's it going? Good to see you again. I'm trying to, good, good to see you. It's been a while. It's been, yeah. it's been a couple minutes. Glad to see you in the Van Helsing foyer already. It's fun. I'm enjoying being here. Um, I've been taking a couple laps, checking things out myself. Dig it. Um, I ran into a version of a, a really cool uh, bartender. Um, oh yeah, yeah, I've heard about him. And uh, yeah, so how you doing? How's things going with the uh, with the game? It's been really exciting. All the cool pieces are coming together, and we are right about to launch. We're launching uh, this Saturday, and uh, just so everyone knows, it's sort of like getting an exclusive invite to. Disneyland while it's still being built, but there's some cool stuff to do. So it's uh, you get exclusive access to like Van Helsing Land and get to throw parties and hang out with people as more and more of the world starts expanding, which is going to be really fun to do over the next few months. That's awesome. 
Yeah. And uh, today, today, what are we looking for? What are we looking at? Uh, what are we going through? Okay. Well, so uh, the emails are going out now to anyone who signed up at uh, zenoscope.com slash Van Helsing Online, which gives you a link to get an installer to install the program. And then let me share my screen. Uh, let's see. Application window. There we go. There we go. I'll share the screen. Are you seeing the, uh, the login page? Yes, sir. Let's bring that up. Of the um... oh, okay, yeah, it's showing up. Cool. Yeah. So uh, actually, even show once you you click the link in the email, you'll get a uh, and you install it. You'll get a little icon that you can put on your desktop to, with the uh, classic Van Helsing hat right there, and then you launch that, and it brings up the login screen and. Right. Uh, you know, you can create whatever name you want. Um, you can also log in as guest. If you, uh, some people like to do that just to get a lay of the land before you decide what you want your name to be. But uh, you have two um, two starting avatars. Do you see the? Um, I wore my hoodie. Man and mind. woman. Yeah. This is me. It actually transported you me in it. So just be careful, guys. It's you're kind of like a inspiration for the male Van Helsing modeled after you so i mean of course the classic is uh is a female van helsing but we thought people might want a different female, option male van then, yeah 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 because because the idea is sort of a enter the van helsing verse concept where you can be whatever your concept of van helsing is and hang out with others that have their own concepts because you can basically create any version of yourself that you want uh but uh yeah that's that and i'll log in as myself, and I'm uh, I'm Van Hamlet in the in the game. Van Hamlet. Van Hamlet. Yeah, it's kind of a in joke. Hamlet is my long running kind of online world name. And so yeah, we got we're logged in here. Oh oh, we got a lot of people coming in. Holy cow! Oh, wow. Okay. Yeah. Okay. And, uh, here we go. Yeah. So here I'll um. Yeah, got the you see um. See the hat? We have the the, the classic uh, Van Helsing hat and um, hat and goggles. Right. Now that's a that's a special that's a special item. Those are special items. Um, but starting this weekend, they're going to be free for anyone who, who logs in and uh, grabs them. That's going to be in the shop. But uh, after that, you'll have to um, you'll have to pay because they are super awesome. But uh, yeah, we're giving them away free. Oh, for sweet. the first users to come in this weekend. I'm not so, in my hat and goggles as well. So. Yeah. Oh, and you'll see the um, see the link to – we have a link to the, the new uh, Discord for Zenoscope here. So you just uh, – you click that. It'll take you right to the Zenoscope page, and you can join that. And uh, we have a, a, a Van Helsing Online channel in the Zenoscope Discord, and we'll have team people looking at it. So if you have questions about what to do or technical problems, just uh, go on over there. So that should cover most of what I'm uh, going to show you. And then we have some other team members whenever you want to bring them on. Yeah, uh, I got it. So should I bring on Dixie? Dixie yeah. and Kurt? Yep. There's Dixie. Or maybe Dixie just to start. Uh, Dixie, if you want to share your your your, your screen, uh, the Van Helsing screen, so you can show customization. Are you there? Yeah. I'll bring her back. I'll bring them back when they're ready to go. I don't. Yeah. I, so we don't get too much dead space. Uh, we have some questions, so maybe we can answer a few things while we wait for those guys. Uh, Chris, sure. if you have any questions you want to pop on screen, that would be amazing. Or if you want to pop on screen. Uh, so is there anything to download today? Mike asks. Um, good question. I don't know. Are, is there anything to download today? Yeah, uh, so you're going to get an email, and it'll be a link to download an installer, and you click it, and then it'll install the game. Right. Check the Dixie. Um, what will it cost? Will it cost? Totally what free to play. Free to play. Uh, free to yeah. So yeah, like Fortnite and other games, it's uh, if you want to pot buy cool items to customize your character or your 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 house, your um. Your Van Helsing hideout, you can totally do that, and people will do that to express their personality. But, yeah, you can play the whole thing for free. Okay. Let's see here. 
Can you show us how to change clothing? He, some, uh, Mike had a tough time trying to figure that out. Can we show that in this um, in this in this walkthrough? Do you think? Well, I, I was talking with Dixie. What was that again? <laughs> Can we? Uh, it's all right. Um, how how to change clothing? A couple. Uh, somebody. Oh yeah. Asked. Uh, he's yeah, having a tough uh, time. Yeah, uh, Dixie, are you ready? Dick we can bring her up. You can see Dixie's here. There's Dixie. Oh, perfect. Okay. So, yeah, Dixie is uh, uh, one of our head community people. And uh, if you want to go on audio, Dixie, you can kind of give people a walkthrough of customizing your avatar and buying items, both paid and free. Yeah. Can you hear me? Yep. Yep. Hey, awesome. Fantastic. Well, that, that is an excellent question because that is my specialty. Um, <laughs> changing your outfit is something almost everybody is interested in and changing their avatar is as well. And um, so we're going to look at changing your avatar first, in a way creating your own version of Van Helsing. <laughs> and, uh, um, so what you would want to do in this world is go down here to the lower left area of the viewer and you'll see a little button that says outfit and I'm kind of hovering over the top of it right now. Mm -hmm. And you just click there and you'll come up with this create avatar screen. And in this outfit menu, we'll, we'll be using this to change our avatars, not just the avatar, but the clothing as well. Um, if we click on, say, the head button, you'll automatically zoom into your head. And you may have to zoom out a little bit more to see the rest of it. But you can see the whole upper part of your body, including your face area. And if you wanted to change this, all you would do is come over here to the, to the left side and change any one of these hundreds of sliders. Wow, so you can really you customize to. you can really yeah. customize your face pretty pretty you could detailed. really customize and let's just say um I don't like this face at all. So let's see what kind of presets they have. You can automatically see the face changing as you move the slider. So there's no question whatsoever what it's going to look like in the end. And then also body body uh, type and body aspects. Yes. Too. Yes, of course. Over here on the uh, on the further left, just underneath head is body. So you could go down and say, "Oh, I'm too skinny." So I'm going to go here to grand, and I'm going to make myself really, really fat, or really, <laughs> really skinny. However, I want my version of Van Helsing to be, okay? Or big boned. <laughs> yeah. big, big boned or less toned. Less toned. <laughs> or, mo or more toned or more muscular, which is kind I would of like the buff version of me. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes, definitely. So any of these changes you can do and again on the body there are hundred forearm length for heaven's sakes you know hand thickness you can make this avatar anything you want it to be yes of course girls there is bust size <laughs> um um, so yeah, one one very very important thing. Whenever you are done changing your avatar and you have it the way you want it to be, save and close. Save and close is very very important because if you don't save your changes, they're gone forever. So, okay. I always I always always try to tell people to save and close, and it takes a moment to change everything. Um. If you happen to save and close something you totally just don't like, go back to outfit down at the bottom left. And you've got this wonderful button at the top right called outfit list. I have a ton of them saved because so, I'm, wow. I'm a fashionista. So what? <laughs> and to start, how many outfits can, are, are, do people have to choose from? Um, just the one. 
just the one. Well, you start as one, but you have infinite options. And uh, yeah. oh, Dixie, you can show the shop where there's items that are for uh, uh, real money, which is gold. You have to buy gold, but also silver, which is free. Right. Got it. Um, on the shop, uh, shopping for clothing is really important as well. I'm just closing out of that and moving on to the shop. Shop is also down here at the bottom left. You just click shop uh, to see what you want. And you've got the Van Helsing hat right there, right there as soon as you load it up, which is super, super cool. So those are free right now. That's pretty cool. Yeah. yeah. And yeah. There, yeah. there is no need in this world to run to the store to get something. The store follows you. So all you have to do is click the shop button. Um, when you find an item that you want to buy, just click on the picture and it comes up and you can see it automatically on your avatar. Of course, it won't be uh, necessarily in the correct place on your avatar, but you can see basically what it looks like. And you can click buy with gold or buy with silver. This one is zero both, so I'm going to say silver just for giggles and you go ahead and purchase it. And then it'll give you an option to wear the item or not now. I'm gonna say not now because it wasn't quite where I wanted it to be. Um, but if you decide that's not all the clothes you want, you've got all these tabs across the top. You can uh, go searching for more clothes. And this brings up a whole giant shop list that you can just search through to your heart's content and buy whatever you want. Now, pretend I don't have gold and I don't have silver, for instance. I would come up here to the top to the sort by. You can sort by release date, the rating of it, the silver or the gold. So I'm gonna pretend I don't have any money and I'm just starting out. I would click silver and then I would click silver again. This will sort all of the clothing down to the least expensive, which would be zero silver. Okay. And then I could pick from whatever I want that, that I could afford at the moment. Same thing goes if you have a lot of money, you can go to gold and sort by gold price and it'll give you the most expensive things in the shop. Right which is kind of cool to look at as well. And the, um, the items we're launching with uh, that housing uh, is our partner Daz Originals, and they they create incredibly realistic avatars, and they're, they're used for uh, visual effects for Captain America and Iron Man and some movies like that. So the, the high-quality stuff is going to be super high-quality. Well, actually, also, um, Dixie One, if you could show the, uh, the photography tool just to show... Did we release that yet? Sure. Oh, the Snapchat I can do tool, yeah. That. Um, it's right next to the shop button on the lower left. It's called Snapshot. And you would click it, and it'll come up with all these filters and, and, and wonderful things that you can use. The first section is the camera section, and it will just move your camera into a different position depending on where you want your camera's position to be, which is really, really cool. I always like floating. It makes me feel so large. <laughs> it's very cool. Um, you can try different poses, like the celebration pose. That That's and the pose I am in all day, every day. Hey, I know, right? It's weird. Or you can walk the catwalk. And there are also overlays and filters that you can play with as well. So you can make your pictures uh, really pop. Um, I was thinking that would be a fun feature in the future, Rob, is that we could do like a Van Helsing virtual cosplay and people could submit images and just really go wild, create action shots and fashion yeah. shots and everything. Right, right, right. Yes, exactly. So, and then whenever you take your snapshot, um, you can save it, you can send it to, I believe, Flickr. Um, you can save it to your hard drive on your computer, or you can send it as an email to someone. 
And I think we're going to add more social functionality like to Instagram and Facebook mm -hmm. down the road. Yep. Cool. Well, thank you, Dixie. No problem. And I think um, so that's a, a lot of the basics for customization. Um, I think Curtis is in the, the combat zone. All right, let's get Curtis. Whenever you're ready. If, uh, yeah. Chris, do we have Kurt? Yeah, we do. Here we go. Here's Kurt. Okay. okay. In fact, I'll, um, let's see. I'm already in the, the proving ground, too, if, uh, you can switch to my screen or uh, we can load. Oh, so that's, yeah, it gives you the basics is, you know, classic FPS controls, AWSD. Uh, the only different thing slightly is you have to click M to go into first person view, M for mouse look. But uh, yeah, Curtis, um, Curtis is ready. So this is sort of our lobby. And this is... Uh, Kind of a proving ground for not only Van Helsing, but uh, eventually other characters across the Zenoscope universe. And so it's going to start with Deathmatch, but we're going to have other modes, and uh, including team play. But then it will be Van Helsing versus Van Helsing, you know, different Van Helsing characters. But then also later on, Van Helsing versus uh, Robin Hood and a lot of the other folks from the Van Helsing sphere or the uh, Zenoscope sphere, let's say. And uh, do we want, Curtis, you want to just launch a game and we can go in? Bruce the Shale Sharks. That is me. I, I, I've I joined the lobby. <laughs> Bruce the Shale Sail Shark. That's me. <laughs> is that you? Uh, I'm Bruce the Sail Shark. Who, like, who, who are we watching Shark. right right now? Uh, is this Curtis? I think that's Curtis, yeah. This, I, I'm in there I should have pretended it was me. Oh, how do I change the first person view? Oh, be shot. No. Yeah, I'm blasting. <laughs> Run away. <laughs> Run. Oh, okay. Oh, wait. Uh... Hey, gonna... <laughs> Bruce, do not. Oh, my God. My ca... my avatar just got killed. Oh. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, I'm back in the lobby. I got kicked out. <laughs> and I think you have, to, you have to run through the door to jump back in. Oh, uh, okay. And then uh, oh. we're going to launch. It's going to be freeform combat this weekend. And then oh, later on, we're going to add oh, uh, oh VHO wow. Guardian. We're going to add a uh, leaderboard so people can compete to be the best in the proving ground in the game. And uh, oh, Curtis, do you have the um, do you have the uh, crossbow? Oh, someone shoot me! <laughs> <laughs> I have you now. <laughs> I'm running. Come back here. People are in Shooters, anytime they get shot, they start hopping, which is probably the stupidest uh, strategic thing to do, but it's sort of, I'm going to hop away. <laughs> oh, I'm out of ammo. No. <laughs> uh, James, I'm chasing after you. Somebody's getting, oh. somebody's getting hunted down. Oh, Bruce doesn't even realize. Oh, oh, Bruce. my God. I'm getting shot. No, I died. <laughs> Chris, you were being hunted. The hunter became the hunted. Uh, oh my god, I'm lagging so badly right now. <laughs> okay. Oh, wait, here we go. It's fine. A little lag. Okay. Okay. Yeah, it, guys, are you using the WASD uh, keys on the keypad? Is that what you're using? Yeah, WASD. Using yeah. WASDs. Oh, hey. Oh, God. Oh. Yeah, you know, we'll, we'll eventually bring this to the console, and then, you know, the. Uh, console controls and so on, mobile as well. Uh, yeah, because we have some questions about how to change weapons. Um, so for here, it's uh, it would be the classic one, two, three, four. Uh, Curtis, are you, do you, have, oh, you don't have your crossbow running yet, but we can know. Uh, we have the Van Helsing crossbow. That will be another feature that we launched with, which uh, you first have to go through a quest to upgrade your crossbow, but once you get it, you'll have it in inventory and it's a, it's a killer. It's like, it's the best weapon if you learn to master it. Proofs the same chart. Take me a long time. Joe and I were not very good at the game. Yeah. All right, we have a, a bunch Correct. of questions. Okay. Um, we should go, um, 
Curtis, we can walk to the uh, Chelsea or the uh, foyer, and then we'll go to uh, Zenitscope headquarters, maybe, while we're, we take some questions. Cool. Uh, Chuck asks, what are the best PC specs to work with the game? Dixie, do you do you have those up, Ken? Hey, Dixie's not on. Wait, let me bring Dixie back. Uh, uh, I don't think we have Dixie here. Okay. Um, basically, it's. I mean, it, it, this runs on the Unity engine, so it's designed to to run uh, basically any device that can run the Unity. But um, if you have a relatively recent 3D card, you know, from the last few, a PC with a good 3D card from the last few years, you should be fine. Cool. Uh, David asks, where can you find the keyboard controls? Uh, on the keyboard? Yeah, those are the WA. We were saying that before. Yeah, is there is there like a a menu screen where you could click on it? Gives you all the the keyboard shortcuts and keys. I don't know. I think there is. Uh, Dixie, are you on? We don't. I, mean, have to, I don't see Dixie in the backstage. I think she. We don't have Dixie out. right now. Okay. But, but right now you're using WASD to move, right? Or you can, can you move with your mouse? Yeah, yeah, point and click. Point and and click. Uh, everything the, is in the uh, is in the viewer. It'll show you what to do. Uh, or you can point and click. Yeah, anything that you do on keyboard, you can point and click on the uh, menu as well, I was going to say. Right. Uh, I know you can hit shift and sprint, as well, at least in the, yeah. in the proving grounds as well. Yeah, hold down the key. Oh, we have an astronaut. That's cool. Um, mm -hmm. uh, the last question we got, uh, can you wander the Proving Grounds and not be shot at? Is, sorry, is the Proving Grounds like deathmatch only, or is not like open world exploration per se? Uh, Curtis, you can talk um, a little bit about that if you're not muted. Uh, hold on. You hear me? Yeah, Curtis is in, and uh, is. Dixie is in right now too. Hey, what's up? Can you hear me? Yep. yep. Yep, okay. Yep. Uh, Sorry, so we just had your video on. We didn't have your. Oh yeah, no worries. Uh, so I think the question was, can you wander around the uh, proving grounds without getting shot? Mm -hmm. Um. <laughs> well, the answer is no, unless you have some friendly uh, players with you. It kind of depends on who you're with. <laughs> but um, I thought right if, now you don't, if you don't start the game, you can wander around for a little bit, but then you'll get stuck in the lobby. Yeah, no, you can wander around, but there's still weapons out there. So, you know, if everybody's uh, deciding to be friendly, you can walk around. But <laughs> otherwise, <laughs> so I'm just kind of wandering around the Chelsea area here. Uh, cool. Should we uh, go to the uh, HQ or should we? Yeah, I was thinking that. We could, uh, uh... While we're loading the HQ, we have a question from Trish. So is there crafting or is it basically a shoot 'em up game? So wait a bit. Go ahead. Oh, oh no, Go I was going to say, we, we have a mission coming. We don't have the crossbow available yet because it's going to be part of a mission where you actually have to go and collect the pieces of the crossbow and put it together. So I wouldn't quite say it's like a crafting system, but, I mean, there is kind of like some progression, at least in the sense that, you you know, you kind of put together her crossbow. And then we have crafting in the sense that you can customize your your character and also your house, your player yeah. housing. At, at, as much as you like. So, and then that it's going to be basically you can you you could turn the headquarters into a New York apartment and make it look like it's underwater or in space. It's uh, it's going to be kind of anything. Um, and then we'll. The, so, yeah. Trish, sorry, Trish had a question too about is there crafting? Oh, or we just asked that. Oh, sorry. Yeah, yeah, it's all good. I had a. I'm getting like Jen just texted me about something too and i want to make sure i get that um we're going to send the email link again around 4 p.m eastern for new people who have signed up sorry so that's what she was texting with me um just fyi guys so it's at 4 p.m uh eastern standard time a new email will be sent out a new email so right around now you should be yeah. getting a new email um for anybody new who signed up okay sorry i'm getting <laughs> Everything's coming in at once. All right. Uh, Pete, should I have received this email? Pete, it should be coming soon. This is a cool space. I really like I really like the different areas. Um, everything looks amazing. Great. 
Yeah, this is uh, Curtis is the, our main level guy, so he's been uh, laying it out. And uh, I think we're going to add even more because we're planning to have a party on the 27th with a uh, live DJ. So it'll be tricked out even more on That's the weekend. Right. That's right. The launch party is tomorrow, Gen or, I'm sorry, February 27th at noon PT or 3 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And uh, so um, market calendars and make sure you join the Van Helsing Online Discord channel as well. Yeah, where we can uh, handle any question you have. I just love the detail of the, of the, the paintings. I think it's so cool. These are all real covers from Zenoscope. Um, it just—it's a very nice small detail. I can check those oh. out. Yeah. Is it Jamie Tyndall right there? It's so cool. And I, th I think we were talking about. Well, I guess I shouldn't say yet, but I <laughs> we could we could uh, update these and uh, you know put in whatever we want into these uh, frames. So. Mm -hmm. That's really cool. Um, what else should we show? What else can we show? Is there anything else we have not we have not gotten to yet? Can can we have a reveal, Fancy Ralph? I, I don't think anyone has actually seen Fancy Ralph yet. Is he? I, I'm not sure he's in the bar yet. Is it, is not sure I'm ready actually? yet, guys. It takes yeah, a while. Yeah, exactly. Fancy. It takes a long time to get Wait, that fancy. So, can I be a playable character in a game? A lot of people are asking, can Ralph just be a playable character? <laughs> you know, be, uh, is there, there, there are tons of inquiries. I, I guess that's going to be another update. Is we going to have a we playable update, Ralph? We can play as Ralph. I don't know what their special skills would be, but <laughs> um, you know, you never know. Mm -hmm. uh, let's that see. Idea. Is there a, is there, so Pete wanted to know if, uh, is there a program to see if a PC is compatible with the game because his PC is a little older? Um, hmm. How would you, how would one know that? Hey, Curtis. Um, well, I, I don't know. I think on uh, Science Spaces website, they have a uh, recommended uh, settings or recommended specs for your computer. But uh, generally speaking, it's pretty, um, Pretty uh, compatible. Like, yeah, yeah. We, we we made a point not to go too overboard with the graphics and kind of make it so it'd run on, you know, like on your average laptop and you know stuff like that. So if you yeah. have something, you know, within the last, you know, what thirty five, years? Yeah, <laughs> maybe not thirty years. Thirty, forty years. Uh, yeah. <laughs> if you have the first Apple computer, you should be fine. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. <Macintosh. totally. laughs> Um, I'm looking at the Commodore 64. Actually. If I have a Commodore 64, will I be able to play this game? <laughs> oh, totally. Sure. Uh, uh, I'll eight, defer eight, to James eight, on that. Eight, <laughs> eight, 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 eight bit Van Helsing. Just <laughs> <laughs> can you sure. change eight bit Van Helsing's outfits? Yes or no? Uh, oh, totally. Um, which is yeah. it looks like I'm streaming on a on a Commodore 64 right now with my green screen. <laughs> um, I'd be into that though, actually, if we had like eight bit. <laughs> David, awesome. David suggested uh, having. David said he tried an older PC; it was not as good, but a newer PC last couple few years should be fine. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Obviously, yeah, uh, the, the newer the PC, probably the better the experience. Uh, I'm looking at the specs. Recommended is eight gigs of RAM and a graphics card, uh, NVIDIA GeForce 760 or uh, ATI Radeon. R9. I'll put the specs in the uh, in the Discord channel. Uh, but uh, yeah, if it's not compatible, don't worry because, like I said, we're coming to mobile uh, later on, both Android and iOS, and also uh, consoles. So that'll be another way to play. Cool. Love this guy. And Max, the, the astronaut's the best. Who's yeah. the astronaut right now? <laughs> kind of crashed. Yeah, he just showed up. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's Joe Brusha is under the astronaut suit. My God. <laughs> Uh, I think that's it for uh, it audience for, questions. Oh, yeah. wait, here we go. Uh, ton lo loves her. Uh, wow, I didn't even know that was a thing. Love this. Uh, going to check it out. Great. Well, thank you. Awesome. Um, 
So awesome. yeah, we, we, I think we're out of questions for now. And I think we've showed most of what we're going to show today, unless I'm forgetting something guys. No, that's it. Yeah. We, we have more to reveal on, on the uh, launch tomorrow. So. so tomorrow at noon, P noon, wait, noon, yeah, noon PT or 3 PM Eastern standard time. 3 PM Eastern. Yeah. Mark your calendars. Chris um, will be, Chris, are you, are you going to be there? I uh, unfortunately will not be there. Uh, tomorrow. Uh, well, we'll, we'll miss I'm you. so sorry. I'm so sorry. I won't be there either, guys. <laughs> oh, somebody so, will be there. Fancy Ralph is there. Fancy, Fancy Ralph, Ralph is always there. Yes, I will be there. Actually, I'm sorry. <laughs> um, and, uh, hopefully, I'll be there in in game. I, if I, I, I'm stuck in the game right now. So if I get out, that would be. It's a, it's a ghost in the machine. Ghost in the machine. <laughs> Um, but uh, yeah, I hope everyone uh, you know has a good time tomorrow. Uh, and again, Ralph mentioned a few minutes ago, if you signed up really recently, uh, a new email address or email blast should have uh, uh, arrived. Uh, so refresh your email cache and uh, it should be in the inbox. And if you ha have any questions or you didn't receive the email, um, you can always go to our brand new Discord server like right here, there's a specific yeah. uh, category or channel just for Van Helsing Online. So um, all of our lovely people from Science Space are on there. They are moderators. They'll be able to answer your questions really quickly. We so found the astronaut. We found oh, Josh is the astronaut. Hell yeah. We found <laughs> the astronauts. We, we... Very cool. <laughs> Josh, you sneaky, sneaky bastard. Um, <laughs> hey, close it on the, the close face it is on the amazing. Wait, do that. <laughs> Whoa! Oh. Looks like to get light year under. Um, that's so good. <laughs> that's hilarious. Okay, well, it, we've said it all. We said it all. We've wow. said it all, guys. Um, I, I borrow that from. I feel like Howard Stern when I say that. Um, great. We will see everybody tomorrow at three p.m. Eastern. Um, oh, and don't forget, we have two more live streams today. We have we are two going... more live streams today. And guys, can we see a little celebration in the room here? Like about the... Thank you, really hot. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Thank you. The game was fire. <laughs> Holy crap. Whoa. Very exciting. Whoa. Very exciting. We have a, a movie club at, at 6 p.m. tonight, uh, 3 p.m. Eastern. So just a couple hours. Um, we have a movie club with Brian O'Halloran. Marilyn Gigliotti, Crystal Star, Sun Kumanaki, myself, Joe Brusha, Chris Sampson. We're going oh, to be uh, talking. Ralph, I'm sorry. I, I, I'm sorry to mention this. Joe will not be here tonight. Joe's ducking out. Of <laughs> Joe's ducking out. <laughs> of course. He probably never watched the movie. Everyone um, yell at Joe for, for skipping on the movie night. I'm glad he told me. <laughs> well... Uh, Not a yeah, it's gonna be really stuff. awesome. Uh, we're we're gonna be reviewing Dreamscape from 1984. So that's from six to seven at seven p.m. Especially oh. tune in because Sun will be around to reveal her brand new movie club cover, uh, which is really exciting, and it'll be on sale on the web store tonight. Dreamscape, also at seven. Dreamscape uh, um, cosplay movie club cover. Yeah, it's um, very cool. A very and exciting. Then, and so that will be in just a couple hours and then uh so so right here and then at 7 30 eastern really just almost immediately following movie club if you're a vip go to the vip facebook page uh the facebook group because we're going to be playing a murder mystery foul play in the french quarter um mm. Science Space really wanted to sign up, but we ran out of <laughs> we ran out of characters. I'm sorry, James. I know you were really eager to play. <laughs> <laughs> I, I sense some sarcasm, and I feel like that's hurtful. Um, somebody's going to get murdered tonight, guys. And uh -oh. I'm just saying, it could be it could be anybody. Mm. It could be anybody. And and anyway, so guys, check that out. That should be a lot of fun. We're playing with some some of our VIPs and some of our staff as well so um yeah there you go yeah. any parting any parting uh information you guys want to lay upon us we lost our graphics which makes me sad uh yeah no, just go to the discord we're taking requests because we're gonna have a dj a, a dance party so 
go to the channel and, and put in a request of any music you want to hear, and we'll oh, yeah. add yeah. it to the list. Music requests are being taken on Discord. Uh, Jennifer is, we have to override some of her requests. Uh, <laughs> so it's already really bad. It, it, nothing before, nothing after 1983 is being, <laughs> she has not, she does not know music existed after 1983. Um, I'm kidding. She does. She goes up to 1987. Okay. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> Anything else? Uh, Chris, we're good, right? We're good. So we're good. tune in tonight for Movie roll. Club, uh, Mardi Gras. Have a great weekend. Oh, yeah. Tune in. Uh, obviously, obviously, tune in on Saturday for the Lodge Party. And in general, happy Friday. Have a great weekend. And we'll see cool. you soon. We'll see you guys All soon. Right. Thank you. Bye.